We do have the new edition of the standard that's been worked on for the last seven, eight years that we're anxiously awaiting to come out. Um, the ISO standard, obviously, ISO 10218, goal being that it'll be uh, adopted as a national harmonized standard in the U.S. to replace R1506, uh, just like we did last time in 2011, 2012. Um, so there's, there's changes that are happening there um, in the international realm, because this is an international conference. Uh, we have to keep in mind that the machinery directive, which has long been the, the law of the land in Europe, is changing. Right? They just announced a couple weeks ago that the new machinery regulation is going to be released. And I know we'll be hearing about that at the conference. So for anyone playing in the international market, especially uh, shipping systems into Europe, um, are going to need to know about that. And then there's a bunch of other standards, right? It's not just the robot standard. R1506 or 10218, that standard relies on a plethora of other standards, other A and B type standards that are also going through revisions, right? ISO 12100 is being revised pretty soon here. There's B type standards like on separation distance for safeguards uh, with new expectations and requirements for new systems. Um, so while the concepts haven't changed, the implementation and the, the actual specification is changing. So this conference is a great, a great opportunity for people to understand what's coming, what's changing, not just specific to robots, but in the arena around robotics and how it'll affect um, system design and integration here in the future.